Hello, it's Flo and today I want to show you how to install on your HTC One X a custom ROM with uh, based on ice cream sandwich. Um, so first thing to do is to restart your phone on first boot mode. There, yeah, my phone is already powered off. Uh, I will at the end of this week start to record Jelly Bean reviews because, uh, as you can see, I have an S off phone so this is something cool i have buy it as off so i can't help you anymore um things is uh i will just show you how to install a custom ROM to start and uh, this is different for jelly bean because you need to install uh, another thing this is uh yes that there for example if you want to install the maximus x you want you need to install before the uh, the image page 46. So we are not then. I want to install the Chim Venon, for example, based on ice cream sandwich with Sense 4.1. Okay, so first thing to do is to download the custom ROM. So you go to download there and you download the 2.6.0 and two others uh, over the air uh, updates. So you have that on your folder here. So I have downloaded these three different files. By this one, I have also uh, just right click and extract the boot dot uh, img and this boot dot uh, img i have just uh, put it on this uh, on these tools this is uh, a tool download on uh, the how is it the name maximux uh, i will maybe show you how to do so on these tools you have different things this is just uh, something to install boot dot img so i have just uh, put this one, this is the Viper X, and this one is boot uh, for Maximex. Okay, so I just need to turn my phone on fast boot mode there, and I have to launch this dot bat to install the boot IMG for Viper 1S. So let's go to launch it, for example, and we have this command with installing this for these things, and I have OK and OK. So the boot is just done for my phone. Now I have to reboot. Uh, my device on recovery mode so just pour your HTC pour off your HTC One X and we start it on recovery mode so let's go you press with that on volume down you press pour still there on volume down and you are here on the bootloader you select recovery and let's go you must already also have patched these three different files on your HTC One X uh, by for example, by this way, you have to connect your phone on recovery mode here, and you have to mount uh, mount storage and mount USB storage. You can see that here. So there, I have my HTC storage, and I can see on ROM major ROM uh, that I already have the Viper X with these three different files. You know, okay, uh, and I have already started for the Maximux later. Okay, so I just have to unmount it. And let's go to do a full wipe. So you have to go back and wipe data factory. Yes, delete all users, datas. Okay, you have to wipe cache partition, like that. Let's go. And now you can install from zip your SD card, so your custom ROM. So let's go to ROM Radio, ROM, Viper X, and install the 2.6.0 install it so you have to know i have just done um, install zip from sd card show zip from sd card and i have been at the location of the custom ROM i want to install and now i am on aroma aroma installer let's go to click next and to install this version you have to agree term of use for viper x there and you have to read it if you need and click next and you have to choose uh, if you want a full installation with all your apps or custom installation or just system and for or other things. I want uh, custom information and perform a full wipe just in case of. So I need the red theme. I don't want to remove HTC Sense and I want to select uh, for removing apps. So I have to remove Facebook, Flickr, Twitter, Dropbox, uh, Dropbox. I want to remove also uh, Google Books, Google Movies, um, Google, uh, HTC Music Player, Video Player, HTC Mail, uh, HTC Task, HTC Stocks, HTC Task Manager, 
HTC SkyDrive, HTC Movie Editor, HTC Hub, also HTC Titanium Backup, No Cheater, this and next. And then uh, I have to choose if I am using a custom kernel or not. If I am not choosing, I come from uh, the uh, the based the official ROM, and there you have to install it. And let's go. So I will just show you the Viper. I have already tested on my HTC One S and this is just an amazing custom ROM. So I need to start with it on my HTC One X. So I am starting to record uh, reviews about the different custom ROM. Uh, I start with Ice Cream Sandwich for this week. I will start just to recording on how to install this, uh, this custom ROM and I have to test Viper X for one day. Uh, before doing a review tomorrow. Okay, so let's go to do that because I, I want to show you uh, how is the battery for example and uh, other things so I need I need time. Okay, and I want to do something very good. So here is for V1 X for Viper, Viper X and if you want, uh, yes I know you are waiting for for the way to s off your your phone so this is why i want to start with ice cream sandwich before starting jelly bean versions um okay there we are 83 percent wiring system so maybe some people already know me because i made a review for htc desire hg and htc one x and uh, I, lo I love to that and uh, I have just um, take my 1S and I want to sell it just to, to be able to, f to do reviews on the HTC One X for you so this is rebooting and after that you have just to do the same thing without wiping for install the two other updates the updates uh, 2.6.0 to 2.7.0 and 2.7.0 to 2.27 to the 2.7.1 excuse me yes it's okay and here is the HTC Quake Librarian with the Venom uh, Venom a Viper excuse me and here we are this is starting on Viper and soon you will know how to install a custom arm with Chili Bean on your HTC One X and I will know that too because I have tested it and it works not very good because I have forget to install the um, the PG46.AMG so I want to thank MDJ for having helped me for that and now I am using a custom ROM from Ice Cream Sandwich uh, I want to say that I am happy to join you with HTC One X uh, this one, I add also the HTC One S there, you have to know that, this is, uh, which custom ROM is that, uh, this is the, yes, uh, yes, this is the Trick Do It version, and I also have uh, another one, my HTC Desire HD, this one, you know, with MIUI, okay, so I have three different devices from HTC, and I love HTC, that's why I continue to, to record review for, for them. Okay, and this one is just touching, I hope, yes, maybe, no, I don't know. So yes, you, you will uh, know me uh, as soon as possible, I hope. You can also continue to subscribe to my channel. Uh, I will post uh, videos, I hope, every day or as soon as possible. Um, and just continue to do good stuff, you know. So let's go. This one is just rebooting, you know. You have to wait uh, for a little while for some time, and it's allocating my SIM card. And this is done, you know. This is not difficult to change custom ROM on your HTC One X. This is just so easy. I have started it maybe two hours ago, and I already have a new custom ROM. This is just amazing because I have already do that for the One X, uh, One S. Uh, Desire HG, Sensation, Desire S and uh, Sensation XE and sometimes it takes a while and this is just so easy for the One X so I want to manually sync my data you know this is the, the, the first uh, stuff to do uh, yes next, agree, agree okay next I will do that later, finish 
okay and you have a new customer working on your HTC One X so I think you, you can just uh, give me some comments and if you like or not what I do, what you want I do uh, better, what you want I show you and all chips I, I can do okay so thanks again to have seen this video uh, I will continue to review a lot of things on my HTC One X thanks again that's flow for a long time